हेलो स्टूडेंट्स अभी हम देख रहे हैं स्टैंडर्ड एट का ज्योग्राफी लेसन नंबर सेवन पॉपुलेशन इस लेसन की एक्सरसाइज क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट कंप्लीट द फॉलोइंग सेंटेंसेस ए क्वेश्चन इफ द बर्थ रेट इज ग्रेटर देन द डेथ रेट देन द पॉपुलेशन डॉट डॉट आंसर इंक्रीजेस बी क्वेश्चन पीपल ऑफ डॉट डॉट एज ग्रुप आर इंक्लूडेड इन द प्रोडक्टिव पॉपुलेशन आंसर 15 to 59. Question C. The spread of modern technology in society is mostly depend on dot dot. Answer. Literacy. Question two. Examine the following statements and correct the incorrect ones. उसमें ये है. The population density of a region can be understood from its area. Answer. Wrong. करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट है द पॉपुलेशन डेंसिटी ऑफ अ रीजन कैन बी अंडरस्टूड फ्रॉम द टोटल पॉपुलेशन एंड द एरिया ऑफ दैट रीजन बी क्वेश्चन द क्वालिटी ऑफ पॉपुलेशन इज डिटरमाइंड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ लिटरेसी आंसर राइट सी क्वेश्चन देयर इज एन एडवर्स इंपैक्ट ऑन मैन पावर इन द रीजन ऑफ आउट माइग्रेशन Answer right. Question D. Greater economic prosperity indicates the development of a region. Answer wrong. Correct statement is development of a region cannot be determined only by understand its economic prosperity and requires consideration. Consideration of factors like a standard of living, life expectancy, number of years of schooling of individuals, etc. E question: Developing countries have an HDI of one. Answer: Wrong. Correct statement is: Developed countries have an HDI close to one, while for countries with very little development, the value of index is close to zero. Thus, developing countries will have an HDI around 0.5. Question three. Answer in brief. उसमें एक क्वेश्चन है. What are the aspects considered in the structure of population? Answer. Population can be subdivided into various categories by studying the correlation between the subdivisions and understanding of a structure and quality of population is possible. Population can be classified as per sex, age, rural, urban, literacy, productive population, etc. These subgroups and their relationship with one another is studied in the structure of the population. B question: Prepare a list of advantages and disadvantages factors affecting population distribution. एडवांटेजेस है अभी फेवरेबल क्लाइमेट फ्लैट प्लेन्स अबाउंडेंट नेचुरल रिसोर्सेस पॉलिटिकल स्टेबिलिटी उसके बाद इंडस्ट्रियलाइजेशन अर्बनाइजेशन फर्टाइल सॉइल एक्सेट्रा उसके बाद डिसएडवांटेजेस Undaltering terrain, unfavorable climate, scarce resources, political instability, lack of transport means. उसके बाद है wars etc. Question C. What are the problem in area of high population densities? Population density is the number of population per square kilometer. It is calculated as the number of people per unit area. India is one of the densely populated countries in the world. The problem due to high population density are lack of open space. High problem makes very difficult to get a free space for a new habitat. There will be no rooms. Or houses or land left for people. 
pollution pollution is the main social problem faced due to areas which have high population densities there will be an increase in land degradation by building houses and flats which makes land pollution water contamination by a high volume of people makes water pollution and massive usages of vehicle will contribute in air pollution lack storage of water facility these area will lack the storage facility for water because of high density the higher population needs more amount of water and storage capacity which lacks in these areas overcrowded the areas with high population are overcrowded which makes the atmosphere polluted and lacks peacefulness the environment gets damaged due to the overcrowdedness question d what are the problems in area of low population densities to ye hai answer question number 4 give geographical reasons usme a hai population is an important resource population is an important resource because it is responsible for economic social and cultural development of any country people are necessary to develop the economy and society they not only make use resources but are a resources themselves also the quality of population is important rather than just numbers the percentage of literacy sex ratio and age groups health educational levels etc are also considered while thinking of population as a resource the quality of population also determines the supply of skilled or unskilled labor question b is productive population is an important group answer In India the population between the ages 15 and 59 years is known as productive population the people in this group of people are active in services and businesses and participate directly in the economic activities of a region in the regions where the proportion of this population especially youth is more the development is rapid hence productive population is an important group can see the study of age structure is important answer the division of the population of a region according to age group is known as age structure the study of age structure is useful for the projection of population as also for understanding the dynamics of age structure arrangement similarly it also helps in understanding the proportion of active and dependent population hence the study of age structure is important question d literacy is directly related to development answer literacy is an important tool which makes the work of productive population most efficient the impact of literacy on economic development is positive the literate person makes the technological developments to overcome the problem in the economy such as population urbanization etc there needs technical experts for ensuring sustainable development e question the real progress of a country is understood with the help of the human development index answer the level of human development is ranked through score of the human development index hdi which varies between 0 1 in the hdi score 0 states 
least development state and one state highly developed state it shows the real progress of the country because the indicators used to calculate the index are income health and education which are the most relevant factors in the country when hdi value is higher then the standard of living will also be higher which will make a real progress in the country question number 5 write note sex ratio sex ratio is defined as the number of females per 1000 male in the population this is a social indicator which measures the extent of equality between the male and female in society the sex ratio in india is unfavorable with 948 female per 1000 males the state kerala has a sex ratio of 1058 females per 1000 males Pondicherry has 1001 females per 1000 males while Delhi has only 821 females per 1000 males B question age structure answer age structure of a population refers to the number of people in different age groups in a country it is one of the basic characteristics of a population. The age classification makes a clear picture of the economical human resources in the country. The percentage of population under the age group of 15 years is considered as economically unproductive population. The percentage of population between 15 to 59 years is considered as economically productive population. The age group 59 years and above is mostly dependent population and they are unproductive. Question C. Literacy Literacy is a very important quality of the population. Labor becomes skilled. Labor when they become literate or they have some skills. Educate people, indulge in many intelligent choices and undertake research and development activities. According to the census, a person who can read and write with understand in any language is treated as literate. India has a literacy rate of 74.04% in India. The state Kerala has the highest literate rate with 93.91% as of 2018.